it's here. The two most award-winning engravers and designers in modern coin history, never before collaborated, done for the first time in the most majestic coin that you've ever seen. Hi, I'm MJ Inveen. I'm Aaron Rodriguez. We're gonna tell you a little bit today about the 2024 Light of Liberty coin, one of the greatest Liberty coin series to ever exist. And there is a reason for it. So the series started just this past year, and I gotta tell you, this design is absolutely amazing. When you look at this piece initially, you see Natanya Van Niekerk's beautiful rendition. And this is something so unique and so special. You, you immediately are drawn to the center of the coin and the Liberty walking forward out of the wilderness, out of there with the torch of enlightenment aligned with the sunrise is such an astonishing piece. What she is able to do is add in the Big Five. For those who don't know, the Big Five is actually the most iconic animals in Africa. And she does it in such a subtle way that really speaks to the heritage that she comes from. This is a design that we're seeing from Natanya Van Niekerk as a previous three-time winner of the Coin of the Year Award. That's the Academy Awards of coins. And to have her as a South African artist design Lady Liberty in a design that's never been seen before in this level of beauty truly brings out Americana in, in a way that is special and unique and will definitely resonate with collectors. For those unfamiliar with John Mercanti, he is the most prolific engraver the United States Mint has ever seen. And he has done so many pieces. He has this knack for bringing Americana out. And this piece right here, he gives an homage to Augustus St. Gaudens. He brings the eagle over the sunrise in the traditional way, but he adds that Mercanti-esque flair to it. If you watch in this reverse proof, those wings, as you turn it in the light, they glitter. John Mercanti, 12th Chief Engraver of the United States Mint, designed an eagle that is beyond all eagles that even he's done. I mean, you're talking about an eagle in an ultra high relief, reverse proof finish, arguably the most sought after and eye-catching appeal finishes, flying over the horizon with the sun in the background that looks exactly like the sun that St. Gaudens would have done yes. in the same high relief finish that he wanted in his double eagle. So we gotta talk about the mintages because I, we have a plethora of different metals available. And there's simply not enough to go around from that perspective, but like we said, there's something for everyone's budget. At five ounce gold, like you mentioned, at the ultimate rarity, but now go down, you have access to different levels of gold and one ounce gold, half ounce gold. So if you can do gold, you absolutely should. That's truly gonna be where the rarity lies. Absolutely. Less than a thousand on each one. When we talk about rarity too, folks, we're privileged, we get to see some of the rarest pieces. And what you're seeing here on the camera, this is the raw two ounce silver. Mm -hmm. These pieces are graded on a one to 70 scale, one being recognizable as a coin, 70 being perfectly flawless down to the microscopic level. And that is what you're getting here. In addition to that, probably the coolest part of the pedigree is you're getting Natanya's personal signature on the label. This is your first opportunity to see Natanya Van Niekerk's signature in a Lady Liberty design when she had no signatures tied to her most award-winning series, The Natura. This, folks, this is an opportunity unlike anything you've seen before. When you think about today, don't take that for granted and do it tomorrow. It's not going to exist. We already know that in the first coin in the series, it sold out in record time. You're now talking about a signature from Natanya Vandekirk. You're talking about a first day of issue pedigree. You're talking about a perfect 70 grade from NGC, the third party grading service that's renowned for quality and scrutiny within the service. This is where the rubber hits the road. You have everything that you need to make a decision, but you gotta do it now. Folks, whatever your collection looks like, whether it's starting out or you've been doing this for years, this piece is an amazing addition. I, I, I can guarantee you that when you get it in your hands, it's gonna be something you're gonna be proud of, but do yourself a favor, call your representative today Ask them questions, get to know, make sure this fits in your collection like I know it will. We're excited to talk to you. For me, in looking at things that I really like, if I had an opportunity to buy a ultra high relief enhanced reverse proof eagle from John Mercanti, that would be enough. If I had an opportunity to buy 
a Lady Liberty outstretched representing Liberty's torch, similar to St. Gaudens' design, including the big five, that would be enough. That would, that would be a reason to buy. I have both. I have two reasons that make me not even question why I should be doing anything other than calling my representative now. If you enjoyed this, if you enjoyed the history behind this, I just want to say thank you for tuning in. I'm Aaron Rodriguez. And I'm MJ Inveen. Thanks again. We'll see you next time. Thanks.